Hi, I'm Chastity Reed. The recent My Bloody Valentine film was shot in 3D using the Paradise Effects 3D rig. I spoke with Max Pinner, owner of Paradise Effects, about his rig. In around uh, 2007, September of 2007, the uh, red camera uh, came into being and we started doing tests with the red camera and, um, and uh, doing 3D with the red camera. We'd, we've been doing 3D for around 18 years with uh, 65 millimeter cameras, IMAX, iWorks, ShowScan cameras, Honey, I Shrunk the Audience, T2 3D, it's tough to be a bug. Um, all kinds of things for uh, different theme parks. And now that we have movie theaters where we can see live action pictures in 3D, we decided to make cameras that would basically play in theaters, live action cameras, not cartoons, like some of the cartoons that are out there, but a live action camera that we could shoot with. We shot our first film, Dark Country, with Thomas Jane in uh, December of 2007, and we finally just got it edited. Well, that's a long story, so I'm not gonna tell you anything about it, but it's gonna be a pretty good picture. The second film that we've done with Lionsgate, um, with uh, Patrick uh, Lassier, um, uh, was My Bloody Valentine. My Bloody Valentine was done for around $13 million, and worldwide grossed around $70 million. We like that. Um, so these cameras, honestly, we've, de we've designed as film cameras so that you can control them and you can use them just like regular film cameras can be used, except they're a little bigger and they take a little more light and um, you're juggling a little more when you, when you shoot with them. So they're a little more difficult to shoot with. Um, we've done three films now, and we're up for a couple more, um, and we keep on making the cameras better as we go along. Um, this has been a wonderful show, and we know that we're successful because we've done three live action films now, and guess what? We're the first ones that did any beam splitters with the Reds. Now there's around four or five places that are copying us. And they're building these things and selling them right here. So I, I feel pretty good. Right now the cameras that we're using, uh, the, the red cameras uh, are, are a camera rig. Uh, they fit on a beam splitter rig that's around 70 pounds. It's big, it's like a 65 millimeter camera and it can be rolled around on dollies or on um, remote heads. Um, a, with wheels or fluid heads. Um, but that doesn't cut it. So we had to find another camera, the silicon image cameras, that was used on Slumdog Millionaire. Ha <laughs> um, ha. We started using them first. So uh, we, we've made 3D cameras that are 19 pounds and can be um, mounted onto steady cams or handheld put into small uh, underwater housings. So it's kind of like our B camera. In old film terms, it'd be like an IMO. It's kind of a handheld camera that you rip out of the truck and do all of your uh, transitional shots with. Oh, well, we've, made, we've made a wonderful little camera, a beam splitter camera that's 19 pounds out of the SIs. And our larger cameras, A and B cameras, are done with the Reds. All our designs are done in SolidWorks 3D. And we have retrofitted what we think the new designs for the Epic and the Scarlet will be into our rigs so that all we do is take the other cameras off and put the other ones on. For more information on the Paradise FX 3D rig, visit their website at paradisefx.com. In Hollywood, I'm Chastity Reed.